Hey guys, it's Phoenix. Minecraft 1.16 added the new climbable feature in Minecraft, effectively making all blocks behave like ladders. So when they made weeping vines actual vines, they allowed us to make any block climbable. So let me demonstrate what this does to the game. Here I am in the nether, and without the climbable tag, this is what happens if you walk in lava. You start sinking, basically. You can hold spacebar to kind of do this, but you don't really end up moving anywhere. You're kind of hovering on the lava. So what I'm going to do now is switch this over to make lava a climbable block. By the way, I didn't die because I have uh, <laughs> fire resistance. Okay, so I've updated lava to be a climbable block. Watch what happens now. I am walking on lava. I'm kind of jumping up and down because what happens is if you climb up on a ladder and you're at the top bit, you do kind of do this. Also, it's not a solid block. <laughs> so I am jumping up and down on lava and I'm not taking damage. So the question has to be asked, if you do this to every block, doesn't that mean you can climb every block? The answer is no, because to be climbing on a ladder, you're actually in the center of the ladder block. You're not on the side of it. So I can make, for instance, netherrack a climbable block. You won't be able to climb that block. You won't be able to climb netherrack. You have to be inside the netherrack to climb it. And yeah, I can climb that lava up there once I get there. I don't think speed actually does anything because yeah, it really doesn't do anything. Yeah, okay, so I'm climbing this lava, but I'm pretty sure this is possible without this tag. It's only because I'm not actually climbing it. I am using it as a source to fly up like water. Yeah, it doesn't change anything. I've made it unclimbable. I'm still climbing it because it's still a liquid source. You can still do that. But I will sink into the lava just like that. Okay, so apart from lava, what else can I climb <laughs> or walk on? Water. I can walk on water too. Yeah. Well, you heard that fizzy sound because I was actually on fire. So water does have that buoyancy that lava doesn't kind of have in this game. So I am like rubber banding off of it. You can see there's a bit of a rubber band effect jumping up and down. I'm kind of springing out of the water, but I can literally walk on water a lot more quickly than lava because of the climbable tag. And I'll show you guys how you can do this. So this has to be inside a data pack. It is a blocks tag. If you don't know how to make a data pack, you can download one off the internet and then just change it, or you can use a tutorial online. It's not that bad. So in the directory, data pack, data, minecraft, tags, blocks, climbable.json, you need this text. You can extract it from the existing jar file. It is a new tag from 20w09a. And simply all you have to do is add the blocks lava and water, or any of them. You can also add, funnily enough, minecraft air. And then you can walk on air. Watch this. Walking on air. I actually remember doing something like this, making air a swimmable block. Still think that's possible, but this is even cooler. I'm flying, but also walking. This does affect the ability for you to fly in a uh, creative mode. So don't encourage that you do this, but still kind of funny to look at. And you take no fall damage. Awesome. So there we have it. Walking on lava, a wholesome prank for your friends. Thank you all for watching. Leave a like. Subscribe for more creative content and news updates and tips like this, Minecraft 1.16. Take care.